Hello, CMS educators. This is a how-to video for how to set one recurring meeting in Zoom if you choose to only have one meeting. So I'm at zoom.us. I'm already logged in, so I just will click on my account. If you are not already logged in, you would sign in with your Conquer Gmail. So I'm clicking my account and it defaults to my profile. I wanna to go to my meetings and I would like to schedule a meeting. I'm going to name this meeting, if it's for all my classes, I'm not going to name it all classes because if a student sees that, it might think, he or she might think that it is all of their classrooms. So I'm going to name this topic Rose Code Classes because I teach coding. I'm going to click on recurring meeting and it will default to daily and it'll show me a calendar. I'm just gonna click on no fixed time and that all goes away and I'm gonna press save. Now I'm gonna press copy invitation and we spoke about this in the meeting today. It is preferable to post this information to your Google Classroom in the stream and in Classwork in a topics folder called Zoom. That's a great idea. So we're pressing copy invitation. This down here is actually superfluous. We don't need it because the students will be logging in from their computers. So from the bottom, passcode, join Zoom meeting, rows, code classes. I'm gonna copy that and I'm gonna paste that in my Google Classroom. For anyone that maybe made 13 different Zoom links and that's too many and you wanna delete and just add the one to your Google Classroom, that is fine. If that's what you choose to do and you would like to delete your old recurring meetings, this is what you can do. You can click on whatever class you choose to delete scroll all the way to the bottom and delete this meeting, delete. You will get an email from Zoom confirming you have deleted it. Also, you can put your beautiful eyes on the meetings tab and you will see that it is no longer there. Excellent, so that's how you create one recurring meeting for all of your Zooms. And also, that is how you delete any Zoom meetings that you may have already created and you choose to delete them. All right, thank you, I hope this is helpful. Have a great day and have a great first day of school.